This guy, so in love with Jody Arias that he planned to hurt two network news anchors. Tonight, the suspect is on his way to Phoenix and he faces serious charges connected to news coverage of the killer romance trial. Earlier this week, Sheriff Joe Arpaio announced an investigation into threats that this man allegedly made. Chris Williams covered the Arias trial for us. He joins us live tonight from the 4th Avenue Jail. Chris? And let's do Maricopa County Sheriff's deputies are expected to deliver the 48 year old New York man in here sometime in the next hour and a half or so. This is the only indictment so far in a trial that included sending social media to a new low and threats that never got this far. That indicates she was wearing boys. Michael Kiefer with our reporting partners at the Arizona Republic broke the story of threatening voicemails made to Jody Aries defense attorney Jennifer Wilmot and defense witness Alice LaViolette. Some wondered why those things and others written online went nowhere, despite the possibility that had they been said face to face, they could have been considered witness tampering. Today, I asked Maricopa County attorney Bill Montgomery. If I get cases related to local threats to individuals, we'll review them and prosecute them to the same degree if we can make those cases. Uh, you know, my answer was, I'm unaware of any other cases that have been presented to us for prosecution. If I get those cases, we'll do it. A sheriff's spokesperson emailed me explaining threats during the Aries trial made to one witness and one defense attorney were investigated by the Maricopa County Sheriff's Office. Both were deemed not to be viable and the victims in both cases were satisfied with no prosecution. Now, David Simpson faces stalking and computer tampering charges. The sheriff claims Simpson described on Twitter wanting to tie two CNN anchor women to a tree and, quote, do crazy stuff. Sheriff Arpaio identified the anchors as Nancy Grace and Jane Velez Mitchell, who covered the trial from Arizona at the time of the tweets. After the indictment, investigators claim Simpson was arrested while trying to leave his New York town with this cache of weapons, zip ties, and ammunition. Sheriff Arpaio claims that David Simpson fell in love with Jody Arias during coverage of the trial and his threats against the anchors were made because they were saying mean things about Jody during their coverage. Simpson waived his extradition, speeding up his arrival here at the 4th Avenue Jail, and the sheriff hinted that Simpson think, may think that'll bring him close enough to maybe meet Jody Arias. Sheriff Arpaio said, the guy's mistaken, that ain't going to happen. Live in Phoenix, Chris Williams.